I'm Derek West, and this is David Fox, my co-driver. So we're bringing you a segment for Ultra 4 Garage. So I was gonna tell you a little bit about my new build that we did for the 2020 race season. Uh, so this is a Jimmy's 4x4 48P chassis. Uh, and so we designed this new car to improve on what we had before. So I've got my old car right over here on the left. So we're getting it uh, tore down and prepped and getting ready for sale. Um, but uh, talking about this a little bit, so we've got the worn winch is stuck out front here to give some more room for the engine. This tucked back behind here. Uh, PRP um, limit straps. Um, of course, they do the seats and our tool bags and um, seat belts and steering wheel. Uh, spider tracks on our axles. Uh, so I've ran their product for a long time. I've got Yukon U joints, Yukon drive shafts, Mega High Nine on the third members. Uh, of course, we run the Nitto tires and KMC wheels. Um, so back to here for the power plant, we run a Show Me Speed LS3. Uh, that has an Edelbrock E4 supercharger sitting on the top of it. Uh, and that's tuned to controlled by an AEM uh, Infinity management system. So uh, one of the main things that we did for as far as a change from this car to the last car uh, was we put a leading arm uh, front suspension set up in here. So it gives me more shock travel. I wanted more travel in the front, but I did not want the shock sticking out up high. So uh, I'm really liking that so far. Uh, doing that put us a little bit wider. So this car is about uh, two inches wider than the last car, and it's about three inches longer, so we've got more wheelbase here. Uh, so we're also running a uh, trailing arm set up in the rear, uh, dual sway bars, um, rad flow shocks, uh, we've got the uh, uh, bypasses, coilovers, uh, and the bumps. Um, but uh, I'm super happy with how this car handles. Um, ready to get down to the Tennessee teardown and see what we can do, see if we can put this thing on the podium. Uh, as far as uh, fuel, so uh, we've got a large fuel tank, so we got about a 44 gallon fuel cell, uh, all plumbed with Russell hoses, fittings, uh, Griffin Thermal products for all the cooling on the car. Um, back here I've got a uh, tool chest, this is where we put all our spare tools, uh, any parts, fluids that we're going to carry. Um, let's take a look at the inside. So it's got great ergonomics. Uh, from the seat position to the steering wheel, all the levers are right there nice and close. Co-driver can reach the rugged radio communications. Um, of course, we've got fire extinguisher in here. Uh, Laser star uh, lighting, so I run my signature blue lights on the front. Um, and then a single LED light bar up on the top. So, uh, but uh, yeah, so wish us luck. Um, thanks for watching us here on the Ultra 4 Garage segment. And uh, be sure to follow us on social media. Thank you.